Hello, Executor. Do you have a moment? Is it something urgent, Miss Lin? Um, I have a favor to ask. It's difficult to explain. I'll tell you more if you come to the Asset Management Center. Miss Lin, you were looking for me? Is something wrong? Not exactly, but I will need your help for a while. Take a look at this. Good morning, Spark. Did you sleep well? So, I had that same dream again. The one where I went to see a live show with Lin? A girl on stage waved at me, and suddenly, I'm on stage! I almost got to play guitar with her. Just a little longer and I would have. But I woke up. Hmm? What? Whatever, Spark. I'm not out of my mind. What do you mean I already told you about this? I did say it was the same dream. But it would be nice to actually go see a show. Lynn's busy, and I don't want to be with too many strangers. I'm just happy about the dream. That was... Yes, Spark sent me this today. Maybe it thinks Ruby's dreams should be looked into. Does that mean Ruby wants to go see a concert? I heard from Saki Fua that a show about the lives of the members of a rock band is really popular lately. They documented how the members got to know one another, all the band practices and their sold-out concert, and edited the footage into a highly acclaimed show. She's really into the band, too. <sighs> but I digress. Anyway, my guess is that Ruby watched the show, and now she wants to go see a concert. Her dreams reflected her thoughts, and she shared the joy with Spark after she woke up. Spark probably sent me this to see if I can help Ruby with her wish. It's just an ordinary wish, but it'll take a lot of work to make it come true. First, the band is not holding a concert anytime soon. And I'm not very comfortable with the idea of taking Ruby to a place full of strangers. I see. So, I want to start a band. Start a band, huh? Wait, you mean us? We're starting a band? That's right. I want to start a band with people I know and put on a show for Ruby. This might seem a little hasty, but I want to make her wish come true and give her a birthday that she will never forget. Right, her birthday is coming up. Nothing is better than having a wish come true on a birthday. Will you ask your friends? to see if they're interested. For Ruby's birthday? No problem. Thank you so much. By the way, you can practice in this room. I will contact others to arrange the venue and the necessary equipment. Let's get this started. Guess I'll check out the practice room first. Like you're good at jazz drumming? No, I was just trying it out. I've never played an instrument like this, and it's a lot of fun. Was that your first time? Yes, but you looked very surprised. That's because you were so good. Thank you for the compliment. Say, Meryl, are you also part of the band that Lynn is forming? Yes. She contacted me. I think it's important to make Ruby's wish come true, so here I am. We haven't decided on who will be playing what, but I'd like to give this a go. I think you'd make a great drummer. If you think I'll be fine, then I'll do it. You're here too! I really think we'll put on a perfect show! The ultimate challenge? Put on a great show for Ruby's birthday! No problem! Are you sure? That didn't sound very good. I'm 
fine. I haven't played in a while, but I'm getting my groove back. Just give me some time, all right? But just how much time do we have? There isn't a lot of time left until her birthday. We do have to take that into account. And I don't think I can make it to all the practice sessions. <sighs> I'm really used to dropping everything I'm doing to deal with emergencies. Anyway, that just means I have to practice harder in what little time I can. In that case, I will leave you to it. Go find more members! Guess I'll talk to Shirley about forming the band. This might seem a bit odd, but are you interested in joining a band? A band? Yes. Lynn wants to start a band and put on a great show for Ruby's birthday. It'll be a great present for her. Lynn asked me to find suitable members, so I've come to you. I would love to, but I don't know if I'm good enough. It's been a long time since I last sat in front of my keyboard. Retrieving memory data. Records show that it has been three years and four months. Mia? My record shows that Shirley's keyboard was damaged when the Ravagers invaded the shelter three years and four months ago. Right. You remember it clear as day, Mia. My brother brought the keyboard to the shelter a long time ago. He rescued an old merchant being harassed by the hyenas, and the man insisted that he take the keyboard as a gift. He was unsure about it for quite a while, but accepted it in the end. Everyone at the shelter was busy. I was just a kid at the time, so I was the only one that played the keyboard from time to time. I think Mia might have taught me how. She found some lessons for beginners and used those materials to teach me. After a hard day's work, everyone used to sit down and chat while music played in the background. We really cherished those times. Now, they're just memories. Surely. I'm sorry. I can't help myself when I think about the past. It's all right. The fact that you're bringing these things up with me. I know what you mean. I also know that nothing will change if I keep wallowing in blissful nostalgia. I need to keep going forward. And I believe I can do it if you're with me. So if I can help Lin with putting on a great show for Ruby, then I'd like to do my best to see her smile. I'm just worried that I might be a little rusty after years of not playing. Lin has a practice room ready. We should go in a bit. It's Meryl's first time too, but she sounded wonderful. Oh, I'm sure you'll be just fine after some practice. Let's go. Okay, just a moment. Lynn, I'd like to join the band. Thank you, Shirley. Mia wants to j -j -j join the band too. Hmm? Um. I wonder what instrument Mia can play. Let's find out. Did Mia find anything she's interested in? Well, she found... This! Hmm. 
Then we'll be counting on you to cheer us on, Mia. You can do it! Time to go see Samir and Huma. Hello there, Executor! You're finally here! You sound like you were expecting me. <laughs> I know what everyone is up to. Did you not realize that everyone is connected to one another by invisible threads? And I'm at the center of this web everyone weaves. I see everything. I felt that the thread that belongs to you is busy trying to start a band. So I thought to myself, the Executor should be coming to ask Huma and me very soon. And here you are. How did you know? You're getting really good at spewing nonsense. <sighs> Where did this come from? Do I need to expose you? Hey, don't you think it's more dramatic this way? You see, Executor. Samir heard about Lin's band while messing with Meryl this morning. What do you mean, messing with? I haven't even done anything. How about, heard about Lin's band while trying to get Meryl's attention? Then she changed her plans and took me out to look at instruments. It's more interesting when you tell it my way. <sighs> well, I was actually kind of hoping your way would work. I told Meryl to keep an eye on you. I also told her to teach you a lesson if you tried to do anything funny. You teamed up against me? Good thing I didn't fall for it. But did it ever occur to you that maybe I knew about it? Bluffing or not, I don't want to dig deeper. Let's return to the matter at hand. So we picked our instruments, only to realize that we didn't know where rehearsals were held. <sighs> so we decided to practice here for a bit. I'm a beginner after all. So we practiced while we were waiting for you, Executor. Samir was right, and you did show up. That's very nice of you. Do you have any other nice things to say about me? <sighs> <laughs> Makes sense. But why did you think it would be me? If we tell you everything, then it wouldn't be interesting, would it? Let's meet up with Meryl. They should be practicing already. I should go check them out. I think that's everyone. I don't think we need to explain why we're all here. Before we start, I'd like to thank you again, Executor. We wouldn't be here if it weren't for your excellent organizational skills. So, I'd like to ask you to be the band's manager. You're the most important member of the band, and you'll be in charge of its planning and growth. I believe you're the right person for the job. I think it's only fitting for you to lead all of us. I shall accept your offer. Please let us know what each of us will be doing. Shirley is good with the keyboard, so she'll be our keyboardist. No problem. Meryl seems to be interested in drums, so she's our drummer. Yeah. Huma was playing a bass when I went to see her. Would you like to be the bassist? Okay. I'm new, but I'll do my best. She'll be just fine. Saki Fuwa was practicing the synthesizer, so she'll keep doing that for the band. Sure. Uh, Lin, Samir, what instruments are you good at? The, the guitar. guitar. Then the two of you will be our guitarists. And it looks like everyone is happy with this arrangement. So, we'll roll with it? All right, thank you for the effort. We'll come back here tomorrow for band practice. That doesn't sound like it's going very well. Morning. Are you ready to start the day? Uh, yes. I'd like to have a rehearsal before we start practice today. Because while individual skills are critical, teamwork is equally important. Don't be too nervous. Just do what you always do during practice. Let's pretend it's the real show and give it a go. Didn't go very well. 
what do you think? It looks like our efforts are not enough. That's very kind of you to say. I don't think we're at our best. Why don't we take a break? After all, we put this together on such short notice, so the lack of teamwork is somewhat expected. Cooperation can be improved through practice, but individual skills? You'll have to teach us how to get better. Leave it to me. Samir must have been joking. Well, let's have her as the last one. Meryl! Yes, I'm listening. You were actually really good, and it's hard to believe that you only recently started drumming. I can feel your focus and your love for music. But... You're too into it, and your improvised rhythm is difficult for others to follow. Others are having a hard time keeping up. Hmm. I see. I'm sorry about not paying attention to others while playing. I'll make sure to keep an eye on them. I really messed it up. Please, just tell me what I need to do to get better. You need to get better at following the rhythm and staying in tune. I was hoping to be perfect each time. You looked a little impatient. Too much stress? I can understand your quest for perfection, but trying too hard will also stress you out and affect your performance. I mean, I only have so much time to practice. <sighs> so I need to be at my best during each practice. But you're right. I'll try to change my approach. I will think this through and start anew! Sorry. I don't think I did very well just now. More precisely, my mind went blank when I heard the music. My fingers were not fast enough, and my whole body was stiff. You're a beginner, so it's only normal to be nervous. If you can't keep up, maybe try using a metronome. Well, mm-hmm. Don't worry. You'll get better. Thank you. And... I noticed something. Do you think Samir was messing around just now? I mean, she's not a very serious person, and it's entirely possible that she was just meddling. But I'm thinking maybe she... did it for me. Maybe she saw how bad I was, and decided to mess up to look worse than me. Maybe she wanted me to feel better about myself. So that's what she was thinking. It's just my speculation, and she will never admit it. Please just tell her something for me. You will never beat me. That should do. No problem. Thank you for the pointers. I'll go back to practicing. Shirley, how are you doing? Uh, huh? Sorry. I was kind of out of it. You don't look very well. Uh, do you want to talk about it? I was thinking about something else while playing. My fingers. Well, the fingers of an angel of clemency. When I'm playing the keyboard, my fingertips scan the material and send a signal that stimulates touching to my brain. I don't know how to describe it, but it's a very different feeling from what I remember. It's almost too delicate or sharp. Maybe it's because Angels of Clemency are designed this way. Everything must be precise, you know? And because the feeling is so detailed and clear, it feels unreal. Before, it was like my fingers were dancing over the keys. But now, I'm commanding my fingers to hit the keys, to feel, to... Surely. Phew. Now that I've told you about these confusing feelings, I think my mind is clearer. Thank you for taking the time to listen to me. I'm glad I was able to help. I'm lucky to have you. Now I feel a lot better. Now I can focus on the music when I practice.
What is it? You will never beat me. Huma wanted me to tell you this. Is that so? She threw down the gauntlet, and I shall rise to the challenge. They seem to know what to do now. They look so motivated. Looking at their progress, I'm glad that I asked you to be the manager. We'll need more guidance from you going ahead. Of course, Lin. One day closer to Ruby's birthday. Good morning. Um, we have a small issue that we hope you can take care of. We booked the venue, but something is not right with the equipment. I don't think they'll arrive before the show, so we need to get our equipment elsewhere. Shelly's been swamped with research and probably won't be able to help. Maybe you can ask the mechanic from Asperia? Cobalt B might have a better idea. I'll take care of it. Thank you. Hmm. I was just wondering if I'd get any work. And you showed up. Sharp as usual. I would like to ask you to make some stage equipment and props for the concert. Should not be a problem. When do you need them? The day after tomorrow. The day after tomorrow. Taking the time we need for installation and adjustments as well as rehearsal, they'll need to be done by tonight. <sighs> I'll see what I can do. I don't have anything lined up, so I can probably do it if I go all in. Any other requests? Do note that special requests might affect the style. It's for a kid's birthday. Will that help? A child's birthday, huh? I guess we can start with adding a bubble machine to the lights and go from there. Maybe even a remote interaction module, but I'm not sure if the technical issues have been resolved. If you know any experts in this area, that would be great. I might know someone. Should I ask them to contact you? That would be great. I'll get started if there's nothing else to confirm. As for technical support, there's really only one candidate, right? Yeah. I don't know why, but whenever I see you, I can tell it's going to be trouble. <sighs> I don't have the time. Uh, I haven't even said anything. It's written all over your face. Anyway, what is it? Cobalt B is creating equipment for the concert, and she wants technical support. Ice cream. Hmm? Isn't it basic etiquette to bring something for the person you're asking a favor from? So ice cream. I want the best and most special flavors from Miraria. Special flavored ice cream? I didn't know they existed. I have my sources for such information. I sent you the address. Come back with ice cream and we can talk. The more, the merrier. Everyone's been practicing so hard. I should bring them some snacks. What would you like today? Uh, all the special flavored ice cream in the freezer and all the snacks. One of everything. Coming right up. What took you so long? At least the ice cream didn't melt. You're not totally useless. Ugh. So you're asking me for help for a concert? Uninteresting. Speaking of that, do you want to see the show too? No. I don't want to go outside. This is an exception. If there's a next time, then you'll have to bring me the limited edition ice cream from the VIP rooms on the top floor of the Oasis. Limited flavor ice cream, huh? There will be no next time. All right, I need to get some work done. Don't bug me unless it's something important. The equipment has been taken care of. I should go back to see how they're doing. 
The equipment is good to go. How's practice? It's going well, and everyone is making good progress. It's a combination of their hard work and your guidance. Saki is always the last to leave, and she practices all night at home. I'm really grateful for everyone's effort. there. Good morning. What does the schedule look like for today? Should we have another rehearsal? No problem. We'd like you to see how much we have improved. The performance tomorrow will be nothing short of excellent. I'm sure of it. Everyone has been practicing hard. And you've been helping us along the way. Hard work pays off. Thank you, everyone. I'm serious about this, after all. She will love it. If we keep this up, we'll be just fine! I can't wait! By the way, I want to go over tomorrow's details with you. People in the secret base. Gotcha! Happy birthday, Ruby! You remembered my birthday! You're amazing! Thank you! I didn't think anyone would celebrate my birthday with me. I'm so happy! Everyone? Come on, Ruby. Let's go see your birthday present. Yeah. 
，雷贝，生日快乐。